hey guys and welcome back to another video and welcome back to my channel and whoever's new thank you for joining me on this channel and having so today i am doing my debt snowball and i did pretty good because i got a portion of my taxes back and i decided to put it towards debt and the reason why I did that is because so I could lower some of my debt and be able to now focus on the bigger debt that I have, which is going to be my higher, my higher um, debt that I have. So with that being said, let's get into it because I think I did a good thing. No, I know I did a good thing because... I could have went out there and spent my money on something else. If it was like back in the days, then I would have like, oh, I don't got no really no responsibilities. But no, boo-boo. I have a whole lot of responsibilities, like $25,760.48 in debt. But let's get into it. I hope this is in frame. Yes, it is. Okay, so I paid over $1,000 in debt. Yay! And, uh... I was like, oh, it was hurting me. I'm not going to lie. It was hurting me. But I'd rather do that than to sit here and still be making small little payments when I can be making larger payments between for freedom, my freedom card, my capital one, or even my student loan. So I paid off Old Navy in full. And Best Buy, I don't know. I don't know. It says 188 here. But when I went to go check my, I mean, only, no, Best Buy. When I went to go check my Best Buy card, it was only at $100. I mean, I ain't complaining, right? But I'm like, okay, what happened to the $88? But like I said, I ain't complaining. So it was $100. I paid that in full. This wasn't 218. It was actually 190, I think it was, because I made a payment last month. So I brought it down to 190 something. So I paid that off. Um Walmart. Walmart was actually at I'm trying to remember what was Walmart. Oh, Walmart was at 333.57. I paid that off. Care credit, 382.30. I paid that off. Now, this care credit that's in collections, I have to give them a call because um, I don't know who I'm sending the, mo the money to. So, I would have to call the collection people that actually has this um, thing. But I'm a little scared because it's like, how do you know that you actually in touch with the people that's in charge of this account, right? Because... There's so much things that's going on. All these robocalls, all these collection people, all these people calling you talking about you have your social security fraud or or you own a car, which I don't own a car, but they swear I have payments on a car. And I'm like, uh, no. But they want you to give information in order for you, for, in order for them to like steal your information. So this one here I have to get in contact with so I'll be able to make maybe a settlement. I don't know how that really works. I don't know if I should do a settlement or just pay the whole $5.90. But this one here, I didn't touch. So I did pay off over $1,000 in debt <laughs> when that money could be somewhere else. But listen, we trying to aim at our goal, right? And my goal is to pay off this debt. So the, the, fast I, the, the more I pay in, the faster I'll pay off. So that's a good thing. Now, I know here it says February total payments, and I'm going to put, I think it was like $1,100 that I paid in debt, which that's amazing. And my debt goal was 100 extra in payments, which I did that. I'm succeeding. I'm getting somewhere. Go, me. It says it right here. You got this, girl. It might not have the girl, but I'm going to enter that anyway. So, yeah, guys, if I could do it, you could do it. I, and I don't get, like... How can I say I live paycheck with paycheck and I'm not ashamed to say it. Um, have I done stupid stuff in the past? Yes, I have. But I'm I'm ready to to how can I say this? I'm ready to change that. I'm ready to make sure that I'm fixing the things that I messed up. And and you know, we all do some 
crazy stuff, right? So, and this is my crazy stuff. So let's, I'm gonna charge at this because I need this to go away. But yeah, guys, so I decided to download or to print from Debt Free Charts. And remember, I was going to use these, right? But I felt like I was doing them each one, but then I would have had to have a lot of coloring to do. Not saying that this is not awesome because this is awesome. I love both of them. But I kind of like this one because you kind of like see it. Um, and this one, if you want this one, you go to Debt Free and Sunny CA dot com. I don't know if you can see it. It's right there. So you can go on there and print that out or you can go on to DebtFreeCharts.com and print one of these out. So I decided to go ahead and start because um, it was going to be too much for me to color. So I decided to start, you know, before turning on the camera. So I'm going to finish it off. So I had 12 boxes to color. And I think this is awesome. Like, I feel like I'm achieving something. Like, you know when you, you, you want a candy and, you you know, they deny you the candy and then all of a sudden now you get in. It's like, yay! This is how I feel. I feel like, yes, I'm getting somewhere. And then watching videos on YouTube that people, ex you know, inspire you. And you be like, I could do that too. Who said I can't do that? So never think that you can't do something. Because I have plenty of people that told me I couldn't do things. And I'm like, what? Um, Yes, I can. Same way you can do it, I could do it. So let's all try to motivate each other. Not bring each other down. There's so much going on in this world that we don't need no more negativity. Let's just be positive and be able to thank God every day that we're here for each day that we are here. It's people that didn't wake up today. And we have to be grateful. We really, really do. So I know I went from credit to, you know, trying to be inspiring here. But yeah, look, I'm right here. I was so close to right here. I'm going to get there. I'm going to get there. Yes, I am. So, and I put this here because obviously it's leaking. Um, then I have my student loan. I did make a hundred dollar payment, but each box is 163. So I'm going to try to make another payment sometime, um, probably next week to see if I can do the $63. So we'll be able to, you know, at least get halfway, you know, everything takes time. I'm not in a rush. I used to be in a rush, but I'm not in a rush. I'm going to take my time and stuff. Cause and then I know that I'm not rushing stuff. Cause when you rush stuff, sometimes you get stressed out. So I'm not trying to do that. My grades are coming out. I don't need no more to come out. So in my emergency fund, I have it at 5000 right? So each box is 50 I have it at 5000 And the reason why I have it at 5000 is because it's for the year. I might, if, I'm, if I achieve, let's say halfway, and I put extra, then I might change that, um, that saving goal. But say 5000 is what I'm aiming for. So we're going to get it. Yes, we are. We are definitely going to get it. We're going to keep targeting everything that we want to target in life. And that is my debt snowball. So, yes! $1,100 in debt that I paid. I am so happy. I know. I sound like a big kid in a candy store. But it's okay. But, yeah, guys. If you find these videos helpful, please, please give me a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, I'm not nowhere near a financial person um but i can help you the best way i can and listen i didn't know what a budget was and i just learned that watching youtube and my sister-in-law and you know talking to different people and i was scared i was scared because i never would have had said hey let me look at stuff and see how much i owe because i was afraid i was scared i was like i can't pay that i don't make that much but you'd be surprised you be surprised what you can accomplish. Please write a budget. If you're serious about it, write a budget, whether you're scared or not. I'm here to cheer you on. So let me know in the comment section below if you made a budget. I thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to share and subscribe and I'll be seeing everyone in my next video.